football. Uh, this was you, you've been a fan of Terrence Man all season. You you say you were his biggest fan. Uh, I think he might have competition after tonight. Uh, so state your case for why you should remain the biggest fan of Terrence Man after tonight. Uh, I mean, you saw it. You saw a full, complete game from a second-year player. Um, I mean, you saw him stretch the floor. You saw him defensively. You saw him rebound. Um, you talk, You saw him muscle his way to the basket. Um, I mean, you just saw so many flashes of so many different things. And, um, you know, he did it in the most crucial part of the game. Um, I think that's what's most impressive. Um, honestly, he single-handedly uh, willed us back um, through that stretch uh, where he just, you know, three after three to downhill attacks um, to defend him. You know, he did it all. Thanks. Next up, Ohm. Uh, Paul, um, you talked about, ever since you became a Clipper, about moments like this, kind of lifting this franchise to places it's never been. This franchise had to wait 50 seasons for this and gone through a lot of heartache. What was it like on the court to experience this moment and take this franchise someplace that has never been before and make history? Um, I mean, it was great. It was great. Um, that, that's my. This was my first time uh, experiencing uh, a crowd like this and, uh, you know, since I've been a Clipper, so... Um, just the whole night was special, um, you know, to, to be able to be in this arena and to feel that playoff atmosphere um, in front of my hometown, uh, my friends, my family, so many important people in my life were in this building. Um, and so um, it was just a special night, a special night. And, um, you know, you, you, you felt it, you know, the cheers, the excitement, um, you know, you, you felt uh, the, the monkey off of, uh, the Clippers back in terms of, you know, getting out of the second round. And you guys have done everything kind of the hard way this postseason. Was there any <laughs> other way to do this other than falling behind by 25 and then coming back the way you guys did? Hey, W, that's all that matters. Uh, whether it's pretty or it's ugly, uh, we will, we'll take it. Um, playoffs is, is about grit. It's about fighting. Um, it's about whatever it takes. And um, time after time, I've, I've, I think we've shown that. Thanks, Paul. Thanks. Next to Miriam. Hey, Paul. Congrats, man. Um, I, I remember last, or whatever, Terrence's rookie season, like very early in the season, Doc would talk about how he would like hang out and, and shoot with you and Kawhi after practice. And, and that, that was, you know, saying something for a rookie like that. Do you remember that? And, and did you see something in him like at the very beginning that, that he could do have a night like this? Yeah, he was a sponge. Um, the second I got here, he was a sponge. Um, but, you know, I got a chance to, uh, to, to, to see him up close. And, and, you know, when I was hurt with the shoulders, um, T-Man was like my sparring partner. And so we used to go at it. You know, I, I, I seen the, you know, I seen the flashes from, from way on, you know, in the beginning. <laughs> um, and, uh, you know, his tenacity was, was what I needed uh, to get me back playing, you know, at an elite level. Uh, but going against him was fun. We challenged each other. Uh, I, I hope I was able to pass some things off to him. Um, but, you know, we, we grew a, a really good relationship. Um, the, the very, you know, second I got here, like I said, because I was rehabbing and, and he was one of the guys that was preparing me to get ready to come back. So, um, <clears throat> again, I got to see him, you know, up close. And so uh, I was a fan from, from day one. We have time for one more. Go ahead, Dan Wakey. Hey, Paul. Um, down 2-0 in the first round, down 2-0 in this round. I think in response to that, you guys are 8-1. and one. Um, How? Did you guys do that? That's not easy to do in the postseason. Uh, T. Lou, T. Lou, um, T. Lou, uh, adjustments after adjustments. Um, you know, got to give most of the credit to him and, and the guys just doing whatever it takes, willing game after game, um, just willing these wins out, um, just playing with straight toughness and um, trusting each other. You know, I, I thought – the second half of tonight, you, you really saw a team that trusted one another. And, um, you know, it's the reason why we, we were able to, to close uh, the second round out. Thanks for your time, PG. Thank you, guys.